Hi, my name is Robert Rockwell, and today I will be inter er, informing you about negative side effects that are caused by energy drinks. When it's been a long day and you're feeling drowsy and tired, you might just think, hey, I'll get an energy drink. Without little thought behind what you're about to consume, you still get that heart attack waiting to happen drink. Today I will explain to you why one should resort, not resort to a high energy boost to overcome an end of the day struggle. Some side effects that will be talked about are mood, are mood swings involved with energy drinks, the amount of sugar being consumed, the taxing of organs caused by energy drinks, and along with some other interesting facts that someone should know. So who's ready to, to know what you are really putting into your body? A lot of people are not aware of extreme side effects caused by energy drinks like dizziness, tremors, or mood changes. One side effect that I will address is mood swings caused by consumption. Studies have shown from lifespan.com that those who frequently drink the stimulant caffeine have been known to have reduced serotonin levels, which is what balances your mood. Serotonin can cause depression symptoms. The depletion of caffeine is a feel-good neurotransmitter, which can be linked to low moods, anxiety, and depression once rush, rush has worn off. Medical Health Administration has reported from 2007 to 2011 that the number of emergency visits has doubled to energy drink consumption with patients having anxiety and depression symptoms. With studies, having, with studies showing factual results of mood swings, why even take the risk of consuming? Mood swings are a problem with energy drinks, but that's not the only side effect high sugar intake is another large downfall. Energy drinks contain loads of sugar, often as much as a can of soda, says Kelly Pickett, spokeswoman for Academy of Nutrition and Dietetics. High sugar intake can lead to dehydration, tooth decay, weight gain, and most, the most common trait, the dreaded sugar crash. Diabetics that drink an energy drink need to watch their amount of consumption. Too much sugar can wear out insulin producing cells, says American Heart Association. The American Heart Association recommends that an average human consumes only 36 grams of sugar per day, where a Red Bull has 37 grams per can. Most of society is consuming four times the amount of sugar recommended giving health consequences like obesity, heart disease, and even a shortened lifespan. Hopefully by providing this information, Americans will start to understand dangers behind high sugar intake, but there is even more behind energy drinks like the taxing organs. Your heart, liver, brain, kidneys are working as they are in a fight situation and get drained from the work by digestion. Typical taxation symptoms consist of kidney stones, kidney failure, stomach ulcers, and a racing heartbeat. High blood pressure is a major concern, says Dr. Ann Stackavoy, a cardiovascular doctor at Mayo Clinic in Rochester, Minnesota. The rise of high blood pressure can increase the likelihood of a stroke or even death. So don't put your life in jeopardy for a quick fix. In all, energy drinks are not good for the human body and have serious side effects upon consuming. Some side effects that I have mentioned are good are mood swings, which can lead to depression, anxiety from consuming. Another harmful effect from energy drinks was high sugar intake, shutting leads to the body shutting down. Lastly, the taxing of organs can shorten the lifespan just by consumption on a daily basis. Although energy drinks sound like a good idea when you are tired or drowsy, step back and take a look at what you're consuming and doing to your body. Now here's a slide showing the effects of Red Bull. 10 minutes in, caffeine has entered the bloodstream, heart rate and blood pressure rise. 15 to 45 minutes, caffeine levels peak in bloodstream, causing jitters and alertness. 30 to 50 minutes, liver starts to absorb sugar. An hour in, sugar crash begins, tiredness sets in and energy decreases. Five to six hours, body reduces content of caffeine by 50%. 12 hours in after drinking Red Bull, body is recovered from caffeine high. 12 to 24 hours, withdrawal symptoms like headaches, irritability, 
happen. And then seven to 12 days, Bobby becomes tolerant to dosage of caffeine and sugar. Effects won't be as strong thereafter. Thank you.